So a very useful screen to have during the startup of the unit is the commissioning screen. So go into your menu on the left hand side. This will only be an installer menu by the way. Go into commissioning. So you can do operation test runs, operation of the heat pump or actuator test run. So you can test things like the pump, booster heater, diverter valves, make sure really useful that you're getting your 13 amps at the immersion. You can run the pump quickly. So let's start a test run on that. So we see that our flow rate at the moment is nothing. I can hear it clicking now, so it's going to start to kick in. And we can check with our sensors here what else is going on in the system. So you can see our flow rate is just activated. Our flow rate is now 28.9, so we know that um, our pump is good. Have a look at the actuators. Pump is on. Compressor and everything is still off because we're in test mode. We're in heating mode. And we're getting a good flow rate there. So we can um, just check that we're getting the minimum flow rates uh, at the unit. Really, really helpful. Uh, so if we stop this test run, and we'll go back to operation test run. And here we can check, let's say, the tank. No, let's do heating actually. Heating. So we can see our leaving water temperature here. Return, flow rate in heating mode. The unit's just about to start up. We can check our actuators to see what's happening. So the pump has just come on there. It's going to run for a little while. And then eventually you'd see the compressor activate. The vertical valve is there, so... You can see our flow rate is good. Check our other sensors if we wanted to just to see how the unit is functioning. We'll stop this test run here. So again, very, very useful in ensuring that the heat pump is running. You can check through, make sure things like the immersion is running on the doing a test run. Um, air purge, very good for system startup. And underfloor heating, screed dry out mode. Very useful if you've got a uh, fresh screed down, need to gently heat that up so you don't form any cracking. You can program in there how long and what temperature, over what period of time, what temperature to run the screed at. You can see there that that has not started.